Hello, welcome back. This time I'm going to be introducing you how to put a DCC decoder into the very nice Atlas track cleaning car, in scale car. Now these are a great little machine. Their only problem is they come as DC. So if you're running the train slow, the motor inside runs slow. If you're running the train fast, the motor runs fast. Well, the first thing you got to figure out is where do I have the space to put the decoder? Well, there you have it. I'm going to put it inside and I chose the M1 two function mini decoder because I didn't need one of the fancy ones. The first thing you got to do is figure out how to take this baby apart. Now you want to be very careful to take it apart because there are some very fragile stuff. You notice those little springs on the trucks? Don't lose them. This is what it looks like when it gets all taken apart. You want to be careful to be soft with all this stuff and of course you want to test your decoder before you put it in. Now I decided I also wanted a flashing light to know when it's turned on and when it's running so it'll work. And so what I did is I took out the original switch and I glued in the flashing light right in that spot. The next thing you have to do is make some basic modifications to the frame and the weight. You gotta be careful about moving this stuff around. You have to make a hole for where the wires will go. So you gotta play with that a little bit and to hold the decoder in place, I glue it, and you can see where the wires are running along there. It comes with a circuit board, and you want to disconnect it from the original hookups because, well, it's not going to be DC anymore. It's going to be DCC. And then you got to wire in the decoder, follow the directions that come with the decoder for where it goes. Now you'll see that the wires are running around here, starting to look like something. Of course, I wanted to solder in the light, the blinking light. Since everything's so tight in here, make sure that you insulate everything. I like to use this shrink wrap stuff. Make sure that none of the wires can touch each other. And here's the finished car, the finished DCC, and you can run the motor as fast as you want even if the train is sitting still. This sucker works so much better at a higher speed. Well, that's a decoder in a cleaning car. Thanks for joining me. Bye now.